update on the Lance County Department activities, school pool project that we've been doing on our school based school based blue clinics for the county schools is 98% complete. And when I say 98%, that means we have introduced um, the information to the families, the parents have consented. We're now on the second doses that's appropriate. Um, the first dose is given um, for children between the ages of where I say school time of pre-K to the fifth grade. If in the grid system um, it's identified that they need a second dose like a booster, we go back the next month and provide that portion. So right now we're just doing boosters. We've completed the high school. We started getting calls once it got out that we were out in the community getting started. They wanted us to bump their time up. So we had time frames, but then we started moving faster and getting, getting it complete. Um, one of the things that I did want to emphasize, what we did as a strategy was on Tuesday, before we went out on Thursday to provide the um, flu shots, we went and did the faculty first. And the rationale behind that was is that we wanted to focus on making sure that the adults is aware of what we're doing while we're coming out, also to vaccinate them, because I uh, remember last year we had a lot of faculty that were out due to the flu. So then when we went in on Thursday with the live virus because the children got the mist, and that is the live virus, I wanted to give the faculty time for their bodies to build up immunity so then when they got exposed to the live virus, part, they would have at least gotten a head start run on that. Um, it went really smooth. We've gotten cards. We've gotten compliments within both school systems that we've gone in and exercised this particular activity. If we had 150 children to do, we were doing an hour and a half. I always allotted myself um, two hour time increments um, to go out on Thursdays from 8 to 10. The staff was back into the office. So we did um, Super Tuesday, we did five schools to knock it out. Um, and we pushed that time frame. We try to always come back in by 11 o'clock. The rationale behind that is, is we told the parents that we would have their data into the grid system, Georgia Immunization Registry, within a 72 hour period. I was given my staff time, but we really did it within 12 hour period. Um, 